What's up, y'all? My name is Rhino Spartan, and I am going to be showing you how to build a tracking device in Space Engineers. This tracking device will save you the headache of finding out your ship decided to drift away while you were drilling, or when your favorite car decides it can go live a life of its own just because you did not set the brake. Now, of course, you can always just slap a beacon on your ships and rovers to make sure you don't lose them. If you're in multiplayer, however, everyone in their cyberhound is going to know exactly where you are. The tracking device I'm going to show you how to build will only be visible to players of your choosing and will have an unlimited range. Without further ado, let's get into this. Unfortunately, this tracking device can neither be copied nor pasted. It can only be acquired from one of these respawn pods. And just a quick warning, if you already have an active respawn pod, jumping into another one will delete the previous one. We're going to go ahead and choose the Earth-like drop pod, because it's the easiest to make a tracker out of. Go ahead and select it. Now the reason why you're using a drop pod to create a tracking device is because every time a respawn pod is spawned in, a GPS coordinate is attached to it and it follows the respawn pod wherever it goes. Since the GPS coordinate is attached to the respawn pod grid, if you remove parts of the respawn pod in small parts all the way down gradually until it reaches one block. That block will have the ident grid identification of the respawn pod and the GPS coordinate will be attached to it. So just follow along and do what I do and delete the blocks that I show you. If you followed what I showed you correctly, you should have one block that has the GPS coordinate attached to it. Now don't worry about the GPS coordinate being a little bit away from it. It's not directly attached onto the block, but it still follows it. To make sure that the block doesn't despawn, make sure you attach a battery to it. Now you can only have one tracking device at a time. Make sure you don't get in another respawn pod or else this tracker will despawn. Now you can do a lot with this tracking device. Let me know what you do with it in the comments section. And if you found this video helpful, please leave a like and subscribe.
Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.